What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another Wicked Wednesday here on the Black and Red Builds channel. Today we're going to be building a cyberpunk metal spider kit right here in this little red baggie. It's not a huge build but it's very cool looking as you can see right here. Very neat looking. Anytime I see a really cool looking model it just catches my eye. That's what I like to go for. So it kind of came in this plain looking red package here and uh, it's not, like I said, it's not real big. I think it's only about three and a half inches big. That's what she said. But really cool looking. So without wasting any more time, let's go ahead and get up top and get this thing open. All right, guys, here it is. Like I said, it just comes in this plain little red packaging here. Again, I got this off of Amazon, so I'll leave a link to it in the description down below. Go ahead and uh, let's open up the pack and see what we got inside. Oop, empty. There we go. Let's go ahead and make that disappear. All right. There we go. Gone. Let's see what we have inside this little baggie. Looks like they sent me a, a neat little coin here. Oh, okay, I see. It's a trick or treat coin, as you can see. There you go, this side is the trick. I'm sorry, this side is the treat. As you can see there, it's got a happy little jack-o'-lantern. It says treat right here. And then all the way around the sides are little pieces of candy. And if you flip it over, this is the trick side. And we have this evil looking jack-o'-lantern that says trick. And then there's ghosts and spirits all the way around the side there. Very cool. Neat coin. It's metal. It's pretty neat. I like it. Okay, let's see what we got in here for our parts. Now, I've built some pretty big models like this. This is a very, fairly small one. This is our instructions here. So, see, not a lot to it. Just a two-sided piece of paper. Looks like we're numbered one, two, three, four. So this is how we'll go down and do our uh, assembly. We do have uh, writing in English as well on here, so that's good wherever it's needed. It's probably not needed that much. Just follow the pictures. Okay, what is this one? Tool usage demonstration instruction. All right, it shows you how to use the tools, I guess. Okay, here's all of our pieces here. They're in little individual baggies, and we don't have a ton of them, which is nice. I've done some of these where there's literally like 150 of these little baggies and it's kind of hard to keep track of them so this is kind of nice we don't have a whole lot of little baggies so that is neat all right guys let's go ahead and uh, waste no more time let's get this spider built
guys we are all done with the cyberpunk metal spider kit made out of uh, different types of alloys look at that how cool is that look at that that is really neat I was a little iffy on getting this one but uh, after building it I'm so happy I got it check that out how cool is that that is really neat man I love this one a lot. This one's really, really cool. There's a, an underneath shot. So you can just bend the legs and get them just the way you want them. How cool, man. That is really neat. Really, really neat. I know I keep saying that, but check that out. I like this one a lot. This one's really cool. Uh, this one was super easy to build. Very easy. It didn't take me very long at all. You actually get... A couple of tools with it. They send you a little Allen wrench there and a little socket here. I think that is a, um, let's see if I can see it. It's a four millimeter. It's a four millimeter socket and a uh, small little Allen wrench there. And that's, that's all you really probably need. But I suggest also using a pair of uh, needle nose pliers just to tighten some of those nuts up nice and snug so it doesn't get loose on you. So uh, most everybody has a little pair of needle nose pliers uh, at hand, but uh, man, check that out. It's so cool. See if I can get a thumbnail here. <laughs> all right, I hope you all enjoyed this build. Again, I wasn't sure about this one, but it turned out fantastic and not a real expensive little model. For these metal type models some of these can be kind of pricey uh, not too bad again i will leave a link to this one in the description down below if you are interested in it also don't forget when i hit 1000 subscribers is coming up real soon i'm going to be giving away a lego kit to uh, one one person out there to show my appreciation and thank you for subscribing and watching my videos i'll make a video showing all the rules to the contest and uh one person will win that lego mandalorian helmet brand new in the box this is in no way association with lego or with youtube it's a product that i purchased on my own and that i'm giving away to one of my subscribers so thank you very much guys if you like these kind of videos make sure you give it a big thumbs up comment stroll right over there and kick that subscribe button that helps the channel out immensely and i'll see you next time i'm true solo and this is black and red builds See. Fun right there.